I come to marry wealthily in Padua. If wealthily, then happily in Padua, announces the fortune seeker Petruchio in Shakespeare's witty comedy, The Taming of the Shrew. Padua, a beautiful and ancient city in the north of Italy, in the region of Veneto. On the one side of the city is Venice, which lies half an hour away. On the other, 10 minutes away, is Monte Grotto, famous since Roman times as a spa resort in the beautiful green Euganian Hills. The Bacchione River winds its way through scenic quarters of Padua. Its banks offer great pastime possibilities for everybody. The perfume of history lingers in the heart of the city. Students from all over the world have fallen in love with it for centuries. As one of the oldest university cities in the world, it offers a vibrant atmosphere with charm that is irresistible, similar to the Prato della Valle. In the middle is a green island surrounded by a small canal bordered by two rings of statues of famous personalities, a place where people study, chat and chill out. In Padua's historic center, you will find anything your heart desires, striking old buildings with impressive features, narrow, cozy streets, and again, statues. Right behind it, the famous Basilica of St. Anthony of Padua. St. Anthony is omnipresent because he is venerated as the city's patron. It is, quote, the most famous and artistically important architectural complex in the city of Padua. Off we go to the Palazzo della Ragione. Such picturesque daily markets and squares characterize this amazing city. And here it is, the famous Palazzo del Bo. Bo means ox. So, the Ox Palace has been the historic seat of the University of Padua since 1539. The Bible shows the way to go to heaven, not the way the heavens go. Once commented the famous and contentious Galileo Galilei, an outstanding lecturer. Most people today can only dream of his wealth of knowledge. This guy was an astronomer, physicist, mathematician, philosopher and an engineer. In this Aula Magna, he taught mathematics. And now, please meet Dr. Elena Piscopia, the first woman in the world to earn a PhD. She lived and studied in the 17th century and became a respected philosopher and theologist. The University of Padua was founded way before this, in 1222. It is, therefore, one of the world's oldest universities. Today, it is a school of excellence, and the University of Padua has even brought forth several Nobel Prize winners. The campus is spread across Padua, and partly even spans the Bacchione River. The Department of Information Engineering is one of them, with nearly 3,000 students. They eagerly study the many facets of information, its transmission, and the enabling technologies. All this has become such an essential part of our everyday life. Its telecommunications research group has decades of expertise at the cutting edge of international innovation for wireless transmission and networks. The main focus of its laboratory is, therefore, information security for radio and optical transmissions, including quantum cryptography and satellite communications. Indeed, even the light can be a messenger guaranteeing secure communication on the Earth and in space. In this lab, they build strong architectures to ensure the privacy, integrity and authenticity of information. Over the last few years, they have been investigating the security of GNSS, short for Global Navigation Satellite Systems. However, their role is not only to play the good guys, they must learn to think like the enemy, like the attacker as well, on a global scale. The world of security is like a cops and robbers game. The main challenge is to always remain one step ahead of the adversary. Another great thing is DCAMP contributes to this. It is a program which brings together six universities in Europe with the aim of establishing pioneering new online teaching in the area of information security. It draws upon subject matter experts from universities across Europe. And which ICT security online course does the University of Padua offer the ICT students of its five strategic EU partner universities? 
Wireless Network Security.